Hey guys, I'm Felix your Thursday here in the Arrow Faction, and this week's theme is Draw My Life, so here we go. So, back in like the 90s or something, my mum and dad met, they worked in shops like opposite each other, and then like my dad was like, hey boy, you wanna go on a date? And she was like, yeah boy. Uh, they didn't say boy though, because no one says that, Phoenix, stop. Um, yeah, so then they went out, and then, you know, on July the 4th, 2002, I, I was going to say popped out the womb, <laughs> but that sounds really weird. Um, I was born in Bath Hospital, which I don't live anywhere near Bath anymore, so, um, yeah, that's my mum and dad looking very scared. Um, also, I didn't cry when I was a baby. I was only like six pounds as well. I was a bit light, a bit so silent. <laughs> um, yeah, and then we lived in street. And then in 2003, my brother was born. And then in 2005, my other brother was born. <laughs> so in about... 2006 I started nursery but I was very very shy so I didn't talk to anyone and I just sat in the corner and read so also that is around the time my mum and dad got married so that's me my brother and my other brother but mm, yeah at the wedding and then I thought it was from my mum's dad so then they looked like that and I, I just I, I just apologize for my drawing skills so then in 2006, I started primary school, and before when I said nursery, 2006, it wasn't. Um, I started primary school, but I was very sad because I was very shy and I couldn't talk to anyone. And even the head teacher came over and was like, mate, you're too shy. And then they gave me a letter and stuff saying, you need to sort this out because she's too shy, which is still true, let's be honest. And then my sister Blossom was born in 2007. Um, and I made my first friend in primary school her name was charlotte and she also she was like hey i do ballet you should do ballet and i was like oh my god yes so then i started ballet and i only actually did it for two weeks because the there was only another girl who was my age and then everyone else who was there was about 15 and i was like five so i was like i'm not doing this they're too big that's still scary then my other sister was born daisy in 2008 and I made another friend called Chloe and she was like, hey, I do rainbows. So apparently everyone did clubs other than me. And I was like, I'm going to do rainbows too. And then I actually ended up doing it for about four years, including brownies. I was going to go to guides, but then I was like, I don't want to. So I didn't. Um, and then my last, uh, my youngest sister was born, Izumi, in 2009. And this is about the time in primary school where I finished all the books that you were supposed to finish in year six. And... The teacher was like, mate, you've, you've messed the system. You're too good at reading. Basically, I just liked reading. <laughs> this is also about the time that we went on our first holiday abroad to France. We went on a ferry, and I don't know why it looks like we went on a boat, with which would literally only carry us, because we went on a ferry which held about 500 people, but, you know. And then, guess where we went? Um, My drawing's not good, so I'll just tell you. We went to Disneyland Paris. It, I don't remember it, but I'm sure it was good. <laughs> And then, um, me and my brother later that year shot a video called Sausage's House Tour. We basically took our camera around the house and then my dad ended up uploading it to YouTube and called it Sausage's House Tour. And, you know, that's kind of where my YouTube thing started. I mean, I made videos on different channels after that, but yeah. And then, this is about a year later, I started gymnastics, which I did for, like, a long amount of time, like five years, I think, yeah. And I loved it. And then I had to stop due to homework and stuff. Also, in the amount, in the time that I was doing gymnastics, I did a handstand in the kitchen once, which actually led to me breaking my toe. And I was in crutches for uh, about six weeks, which was not the best. Then, in 2013, I left primary school and left and went to secondary school. 
which was very scary because I was shy in primary school anyway, so this wasn't a fun time. <laughs> and this is also about the time where my dog Star had puppies, and one of them was called Flo, which is now my dog now, and Flo's pretty great, so. She's a pug, three-quarter pug, one-quarter shih tzu, and now we have nine dogs, so, you know, it's a bit out of control. This was also around the time where my mum and dad got a divorce, you know, life happens. <laughs> Oh, and in, like, 2015, I think, I went in and did an audition for Brits Got Talent. Um, I didn't get in because I couldn't do... I don't have any talent, but, you know, I tried. And so after that, I made a YouTube channel, which I'm still on now, called Fee Got Flair. Before that, I was playing on different channels, but I knew when I made the channel, I was like, this is going to be the channel that I, I keep. And then, about a year later, I was looking at my sub count, and I hit 100. And I was so happy, I was over the moon, I didn't expect to get to 100. My other channel only got to like 10, so I was like, oh, I wouldn't expect so much. And then I made a bunch of internet friends. I don't know why I drew them in boxes, but, you know. Um, I made one called Taya, Serena, Cora, Anisia, and then Mark, Aaron, and Will. I also met Taya and Mark, Aaron, and Will um, earlier this year, which was amazing. And then another thing that happened in 2016 was that a bunch of my friends I've been friends with, including Charlotte, I stopped being friends with them due to reasons I'm not going to say. But now I'm friends with a bunch of guys, which are, they're just amazing. I love them. So, yeah. And then in the end, the end of 2016, Annie posted a video on the Oh My Gosh TV and Two Plus Stare channels saying that today we're holding auditions. And I was like, yes, so I made my video. And then a few weeks later, I got an email back saying, you're in, we're making a new channel, you're in. So then after I uploaded my video, I did get quite a few hate comments, which was a given seed as we uploaded on Caleb's channel. But I was quite sad about it. But then I realised that you can't please everyone. So I can do this. Um, and a few a few weeks ago, I hit 300 subscribers on my channel, and at the moment, it's like a heat wave in the UK. It's 34 degrees. It was today, which is not great. And tomorrow, I start my mock exams, which is not the best for my GCSEs, which is pretty important. Um, I lost the audio to this clip, and I actually talk on it, so that's kind of awkward. But like, I'm just going to talk you through it. Basically, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked, please give it a thumbs up down below and comment down below the most memorable part in your life. Mine is probably having a lot of siblings and, or like the thing that shaped your life. And subscribe to the Air Faction and Vigot Flair. And I'll see you guys next time with another new video. Don't forget to remember to celebrate life. Bye!